Um, okay, can't do anything with that. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh, God! Okay, I'm just thinking about what to do next. Oh, we still have to solve the crash register puzzle. Um, nothing in the new area that I unlocked with the key. At least I don't think so. I'm gonna go check again around there, see if there's anything I could find. If not, then we have to try and solve that crash register puzzle. Okay, so I went to the mirror world in the, uh, the intensive care area, and I didn't think before to check this door, but yeah, we could go out this door, see what are in the other rooms. Oh, oh, what is this? A uh, metallic cylinder is lodged into the mouth. Ooh. Oh, shotgun shells, thank you. Make sure I'm loaded up on everything. Okay, I'm good. Alright. Ooh. Needed that. What the heck is this room? Ooh, a hammer. A hammer with a wooden handle. Um, what's around to hammer? Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh god. Light it up. Take it out. Oh god, I missed. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go back. <laughs> Hold on, I'll be right back. Alright, took him out. Sweet, okay. Oh. All right. Oh, okay. yeah, I don't wanna... Something bad happened today in a uh, wrestling, but yeah. All right, so anything else we could look around for here? medicines. Oh, right. Here we go. The plastic arm for a mannequin, so we could fix father's arm. Uh, let's check the other rooms. Hold up. Alright. Just flowing with blood, Jesus. Can I attack? Not too dark. Alright. Um, I may have to come another way. Hold on. Can I use the hammer here? Oh wait, I can probably do this, right? There we go. I didn't see the rope earlier. 
And... Boop. There we go. A parchment scroll on a decorative uh, metal casing. Alright, the monkey thief. The judge read the sentence aloud in an unwavering voice, his fingertips sliding rapidly over the small, bu over the small bumps covered, uh, that covered the surface of his paper. The defense attorney seemed hypnotized by the angry movements of the judge's lips. The accused mother wrote in capital letters frantically on a slip of paper that she lifted over her head in desperation. The gavel hit the victim, its victim resigned. And so, the cold blade inevitably fell onto the innocent's neck. Okay. Can't go this way. Alright, good as new. Oh. Oh, it fell. Uh, huh. Let's check this out. Can we hammer it in? <laughs> Let's try hammering it in. Doesn't fit. Doesn't fit. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Still space between the pieces. Alright, yeah, that's gonna keep on falling. I'm not sure what to do then. Okay, so having a bit of issues uh, on what to do next, <laughs> as usual. Uh, we got the mannequin arm for the dock, but when you put it on, it falls off. We got this thingy, whatever it is. Got a hammer. Got to figure out what that does. Time to explore the whole mansion again, or hospital. I'll skip the boring parts, and uh, yeah. Okay, so... I just came upon this, uh, and we're gonna just gonna put that there. All right. Missing a piece though. Yeah. Let's see what that does after. All right. All right. So we're gonna try and tackle this freaking puzzle here. Still no clue how to interpret it with the with this. Like, yeah, I'm at a loss. <laughs> uh, was this one? Okay, dot, 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 dot. Four numbers. <laughs> I could go through this as like one 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 one, one 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 two. <laughs> Let's take a wild guess here. Hold on, I just want to see. Uh, examine. I forget the other lines. I'm just gonna go by. So I'm, I'm assuming the last number is two, by the looks of this. Three was on the bottom. We 
would go up to nine. Okay. Uh. Just checking the other notes to see if there's anything. No. <sighs> Thick guess. Six, four, nine, two. Nope. <laughs> it's gonna be a while. Sorry, I'm having a oh my goodness moment. So, the circle is touching two interconnecting lines. The circle on the bottom, that equals three, is touching three interconnecting lines. I think I got it. I think I got it. Uh, so, zero, one, Two, three, four, zero, four, one, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. Wait, let me let me go through that again just to make sure. Uh, zero, four, one. One four zero four one four. All right, I'm gonna guess that zero four one four. Uh, zero four one four. Aha! Yes. <laughs> All right. What is this? Uh, strange coin with some sort of symbol. All right, that's that. I'm assuming it goes into the pedestal or whatever it is under the stairwell. Let's go put it in. Or does it? Hold on, or does it do this? No, it can't, okay. Might not be it. No, it won't fit. Okay, so I'm thinking then we put the mannequin arm the, on the father, and then we put that little piece in where there's a gap. That's what I'm thinking. Where was it again? And then use this. Ah, uh, crap. How would I make it stay on then? Strange coin with some sort of symbol. Wait, can I put this in a vending machine? Going back to the vending machine. How much is this coin worth though? Is it <laughs> worth more than what I'm getting out of the vending machine? Whatever it's called, the super coal or whatever the hell. Okay, here we go. Is this a drink called again? Maximum Cola. Okay. Here we go. Boop. Oh, this one's lighting up. Oh. 
Oh, it's friggin' Simon Says. Ah, crap. Refund, okay. Big filled with blood. Yeah. Uh, where would this go then? Who needs blood? You need blood, Jesus? Alright. Uh, cannot be combined. Okay. What now? What now? What now? Okay, we're doing this again, because my dumbass thought a piece was missing, but there's no thingy here to do that. So, I'm a dumbass. So we're going to try this. Um, so let me get the story again. I've been wandering around for so long, being an idiot, but whatever. Uh, the judge read the sentence aloud in an unwavering voice, his fingertips sliding rapidly over the small bumps that covered the surface of his paper. Voice. The defense attorney seemed hypnotized by the angry movements of the judge's lips. The accused mother wrote in capital letters found again on a slip of paper that she lifted over her head in desperation. The gravel hit, its victim resigned. And so the cold blade inevitably fell onto the innocent's neck. Alright. Okay, we have to put this here. Right. Um. Oh, wait. Is this what this is for? I guess so, okay. Alright. So, hear no evil, speak no evil, see no evil, and... Off with the head. <laughs> Those are the options. Okay. We got this. Okay. The judge read the sentence in a firm voice while his fingertips glided rapidly over small bumps on the paper. So... Is he actually looking at the paper, or just putting his fingertips over the bumps to get... Hold on. To get the, uh... To know what the sentence is, without actually reading and looking. Um... I guess? The defense attorney seemed to be mesmerized by the judge's lips engaged. That. The mother of the accused. Euphoric wrote down... The giant with capital letters on a large piece of paper and then raise it. Alright, this may be the last time I try this, and then I'm gonna look it up. Okay, we're looking it up. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> okay, here we go. Um Tormented Souls, Monkey Thief. Monkey Puzzle. <sighs> Alright. Hope this explains it so I get it. Okay, so there's an image. Ah, oh, I got it mixed up. So, that last attempt, I was close. See no evil, and I think I had these two mixed up. I had to hear no evil here, and speak no evil. But here, no evil was right here. Oh, because he... He was... Oh, right. He was looking at his lips moving... Ang... Uh, like... Angrily or whatever. But he wasn't hearing him. Uh, okay. 
Yeah, the defense attorney seemed to be mesmerized by the judge's lips and rage movement. Oh, okay. And the last one was speak no evil. Because she wrote down... Ow! Ah, so upsetting. Can't believe I didn't get that. Oh, well. Well, on the upside, this is the only thing I had to look up today. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you. Uh, use staple gun. The power is adjustable. Oh, can I staple the arm to uh, the mannequin? Examine. Uh, okay, that's loose. That's hard. I'm guessing loose is not that powerful and hard and like tight is powerful. All right, let's go test this out. I know it's been like probably an hour or so, Father, but I'll be right back. Should have died already. <laughs> the, the amount of blood he's losing. Uh, here we go. Uh, back an arm. And staple it. There we go. That should work. All right, we're good. Hey, you got your arm back. Father, are you okay? Carolyn, my child. That thing has stolen my Bible. Stay there, Father. Right now, it's vital that you keep calm. Yes. You're right. I don't know how I'll be able to thank you for taking care of my arm, my child. What are you talking about, Father? It wasn't me. It was but I saw you. Oh. oh. You are right. I'm getting confused. William's here? Now that I think about it, it was Dr. William who treated my arm. Dr. William, the Wildberger twin's father. Is he in the mansion? I had no idea Dr. William had daughters. Where can I find him? He's usually in his office. You'll probably find him there. I'll go find him. He might be able to give me some answers. All right. Oh, we take this. I'm sure it'll be more useful to you than me. Thank you, Father. I'm sure this will be of help. Don't know why his voiceover wasn't there. God be with you, child. Uh, no. Oh, sweet. This is gonna help so much. E um, can I switch it? Turn on, please. Turn on, please. Wait, it's already on. Okay. Uh, I don't need this anymore. Hold on, I'm about to go beat some ass in the dark. Let's do it. Ah, oh, so good to have light in the dark. So there's this guy over here, and then in the east wing area, towards the laundry and the other room. Okay. What's up? Alright. Oh, nope, not yet. Almost. Come on, there we go, you're dead. Ah, that's great. Oh, shit! <laughs> Alright. Want this to be an easy, uh, easy one. this and I guess that opens in the present world present day world or whatever and then we could uh, come back in this room and get whatever that was on the table Boop.
Okay, what is this? Is this that electrical lance thing or whatever? A homemade stabbing weapon made a capable of releasing an electrical char charge. Sorry, had a burp. Another first aid kit. Thank you. All right. Um, where is it? Here we go. Equip. All right, I'll try this out later. I actually know who to try it out on. The other monster. Alright, I'm just gonna skip ahead to where the other monster is, by the laundry room. Oh, Jesus. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, we're going the other way. <laughs> I think monsters are in new areas now. Take the elevator down. Hold on, I'm gonna save it. Something tore off one of the priest's arms. Thankfully, the doctor, William, surgically replaced it with a new one. I didn't even realize a procedure like that was possible. I also discovered that William is the father of the twins in the photo. I should go to his office to see if he can give me some useful information. Where is his office anyways? Um, kitchen, shower room. This is where I'm gonna go. Take out that little, the little monster that's in over here. Uh, east wing, newborn, maternity ward, blah, 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 dentist room, bedroom, office. This is it. But I can't go through that door. I have to go through this door. I need a disc or something. Uh, we're gonna go take care of that, I assume. Try to go around it. Ah! Don't really need to fight these things. Oh god. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay. Oh my god, there's one here. I hear it. Territory, what's in here? There's not a oh, these aren't doors. My bad. Laundry room. Here we go. Something's laundering right now. Oh, new page. This is Maria's diary. 
uh, November 14th, 1980, Anna and Emma may be identical twins, but their personalities are quite different. Anna is an extrovert, a noisy, and attentive girl, while Emma is, a quiet, is quiet and distant. Some days ago, and after much effort, uh, I finished making two beautiful dresses for them. Uh, took them a single afternoon to almost completely destroy them. They came back from the forest, covered in dirt from head to toe, with twigs and leaves in their hair. The dresses were torn and frayed. For a brief moment, I almost flew into a fit of rage. But I, pers but I pursed my lips and, after taking a few deep breaths, explained through my tears just how much work those dresses took to make. Anna's eyes became misty and she babbled an apology, her eyes fixed on the floor. She seemed very regretful. On the other hand, Emma started right, stared right at me with a clueless expression and then for only a second a mocking grimace appeared on her face. Her cold eyes froze my heart immediately. Terrified by that expression and not knowing what else to do, I sent them to their rooms. They did not dine that night. Huh. Oh god, what's in here? Oh boy. Shut tight. Oh god. Um, what can I open it with? Crowbar? Nope. Um, okay, can't do anything with that. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Oh god! Uh, empty box with a medallion shaped mold. Ah. Uh, guess I need something here. Um. <laughs> it's floating. If this is anything like Parasite Eve, this is a good room. Now we we already saw everything at the beginning. No point now. Oh god. Okay. Thank you for the first aid. Relief. Thank you for that. What's that mean? Pick up five first aid kits, okay. Uh, such an awful way to die. Oh, something. Oh, the disc. The floppy disc. Floppy. Uh, the floppy disc names are written on the front. Jawad, Tamar, Lomar, Judith, Avital, Tisha, Milka, Shalon, Lois, Kala. Shotgun shells. Thank you. Uh, high pressure. Blah, 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 whatever that means. Okay, we got to go to the um, the warehouse area. Which way is the warehouse area? All right, so it's this way, faster way. <laughs> Uh, 
key. <laughs> Enter. Error, discard is protected. Unprotected. How do we do this? Alright, what do we do here? Oh, 3 plus 6 minus 9. There we go. That's probably for another thing. Should be good now, right? There we go. Over and complete. Take that. I guess I'm gonna go use it on the door. After I got the arm and everything. You know what? I, I played a good bit. It's a nice stopping point for me. Um, I, I'm going to end it here. And next part, I'll uh, skip ahead to what we have to do. Um, yeah, it's, it's been a ride. It's been good. Love it. liking it. Um, I'm going to say that a little disappointed on the lack of like bo bosses. I assume this is a sh like a maybe like eight nine hour game. Played a couple hours so far. I'm assuming the monster in the operating room was a boss. Um, but, but even with that, it took like maybe one sh one or two shotgun hits to kill it. Plus like a couple hits with the crowbar. But since then, just. No other mon like no other boss feeling like monster, but other than that, it's been good. Puzzles have been uh, puzzles have been great. I'm liking them. Uh, like how to solve them and everything. Uh, I felt really smart this part. <laughs> well, I mean this session because this session I I did all the uh, key combinations in one go. Well, most of them. Well, in in succession. It didn't take that long for me to figure them out. The only issue I had was with the uh, the arm, uh, the monkey puzzle, which I did have to look up. But uh, oh well. Hope you guys enjoyed. I shall see you in the next part. <laughs>